Ready? Okay. Hi, this is John. I'm a volunteer here at the boat shop. Um, John McMillan. We're working on um, getting a level winder, a manual level winder for the spool. And the principle is to to have the ability to to uh, to, to get the cable to follow uh, nicely on the spool and not overlap. And whereas it used to be done with a crowbar, this this apparatus that I built should uh, avoid. Uh, the, the hazards of using uh, a crowbar, so and you can just work it back and forth, here, and, and possibly just yeah, one guy can operate and both the clutch, brake, and this at the same time when we're bringing the boat up. So, uh, we um, first, haven't so tried it yet, but I'm looking forward to seeing if it works. So, and this is the winch for the uh, for the both carriage systems, um, and uh, we're working just on the smaller. A smaller winch, which will be for the inside carriage system. Um, how do those? Mo uh, how's the stuff back here work? work for the uh, what powers this is the electric motor and uh, two uh, Model T transmissions, I believe. I know this one's Model T anyway. Um, to to activate the system and. Um, uh, Typically, we run this in first or second gear. If we're doing this side, we put first or second gear, but also put that in reverse, because this spool for the big carriage uh, operates in a different direction. So, uh, it's been here a long time, and we're hoping to get it back, into, back in service again. All right, John, thank you for your time. You're welcome.